Hey there guys, so today I have a really super huge haul and I was actually thinking of making two separate videos like splitting the haul but Honestly, like I don't think that's gonna work because it's mainly like just makeup and then a few other non-makeup products So without wasting any time, let's get started. Okay, so the first store that I'm gonna talk about is Target um, It's one of my favorite stores. Oh, and by the way, this is a collective haul meaning that I collected these items throughout like several days and a few months this was actually yesterday though. So yesterday I went to Target and I purchased some shoes for Adriana um, by Cherokee. It's these cute little shoes. They're like bright, bright yellow, like a neon yellow. Oh, it looks so pretty next to my lipstick. <laughs> but honestly, but I think I'm gonna actually exchange them for something else because I don't think she likes them a lot. Because whenever I put them on her, she was kind of complaining about this hurting like the middle of her or in between her toes. So I'm not sure if we're going to keep those, but I really, really do like them a lot. I think she wants to come with me. You want to say hi, Adriana? <laughs> you want to do the haul with me? Do the haul with me, okay? So these are her shoes right here. Did you like these, Adriana? Were these uncomfortable? Tell your fellow baby followers if these are comfortable. <laughs> what else? And we also got Adriana um, her shampoo. You were out of shampoo, right, Adriana? Or you're almost out of shampoo, so we needed to get some shampoo ASAP. Okay, so next item is actually, like, my stuff. I got these sandals. They look like this. They're, like, kind of like a white gold. They're not, like, a gold gold, but they're, like, a white, white gold. And then I got some other gold sandals, and these are kind of, like, the braided kind of type of sandal. I don't know what these are called, but they have a little braid in the middle. And then I also got this e.l.f. what's it called? Mascara and Shadow Shield. So basically, if you already have your foundation on and you don't want to mess up your foundation by having eyeshadow fallout, you just grab this thing, put it underneath your eye, and I've been looking for one of these for like ever. Um, so you just hold it like this and then do your eyeshadow and it's supposed to catch every single fallout and this was only three dollars and the last thing i got from target is this really pretty dress it looks like this it's like all black from the top and then it has this small white and black print at the bottom and i don't know if you guys can tell but it does have pockets right here so kind of like that okay so that's it for the target haul now we're gonna move on to the next one okay, so i recently went to the out, cosmetic outlet store and I got a few things okay, so I wanted to try this Estee Lauder double wear foundation so I ended up getting it and honestly I think this foundation made me break out but I'm just gonna give it one more shot before I hate it I got this pigment right here it was only $14.75 compared to however much they cost like $20 and it's just a really pretty like super hot pink and then I also got this eyeshadow this one is called expensive pink and I've heard a lot of people rave about this eyeshadow so I wanted to give it a shot it was only like ten dollars all right so now it's time for the beauty supply store which I love I've never been to a beauty supply store until like just recently probably like a month ago and oh my gosh I I died and then I was reincarnated and then I died again because the lashes there are like a dollar and they're real human hair. So I just, I bought a whole bunch of them because I was going to do uh, prom makeup. Adriana's pooping. Okay, so I'm just going to tell you real quick. I got these right here. 
And then I also got these that are a little bit more natural but like super long. They're so pretty. I got a bunch of individual lashes. And then I got these right here. These are doubled which if you buy them at Sally's they're probably like $6 or maybe like $8. And then I got some short ones because I do have clients that don't want super super long lashes. They just want like the thickness of the lashes so yep okay so I had to take a little break to change her diaper but that's done so I'm just gonna continue with the beauty supply okay so after the lashes I bought some eyeshadow primer and this is the Ruby Woo wait no wait um oh I was thinking of the MAC lipstick okay so this is the Ruby Kisses eyeshadow primer it's supposed to be similar to the Urban Decay Primer Potion. It even looks like the old uh, the old packaging of the Urban Decay Primer Potion. I have not tried this. It's probably been sitting in my drawer for like two months and I haven't even opened it. And then I also got a couple of liquid glitter liquid liners which I am obsessed with. Um, I haven't tried these. I'm just obsessed in general like with liquid liners. Like literally gl glittery liquid liners. So I got one in turquoise, I got one in blue and gold, and these are still Ruby Kisses. And by Ruby Kisses again, I got this Super Mascara in Waterproof. It's actually a blue, or it's supposed to be a blue mascara. So have you guys ever been to a Nordstrom rack? Well, I haven't. Um, at least not until recently. So I got a couple of things. I went there, I don't even know why I even went there, but, oh yeah, I think I was looking for some makeup brushes, and I just, I decided to go in there, and it was so different from what I was expecting, so I noticed they had makeup there for cheaper than what they sell at the actual, like, Ulta's or Sephora's, and I was like, oh my god! I got three eyeshadows by Stila, you know, they're single shadows, um, Guess how much they were? They were only $3.60. These originally retail for like from $18 to $20. So I can't exactly remember, but somewhere in between. This is the darker color. This is more of a minty green color. And this is more of a baby blue color. I'm excited to try those. They've been sitting again in my drawer for about two months because I have been wanting to do this haul but I just never find the time until now that I have all these products and it's a huge haul. Oh, sorry, I just ran out of breath. Okay, so I also got this Smashbox eyeliner palette which I thought was so cool and I only paid like $15.97 before tax and it was originally $32, really? But see how little of a product you pay for? $32, originally I only paid $15, okay? Okay, so next is Sephora. Got this new highlighter by Sephora. This collection just came out like two days ago, at least where I live. It just came out like two days ago and... Ooh, okay, ooh, okay. I'm dropping everything. And this one's in Light Beam 02 and I'm wearing it right now. It's so so pretty so I recently recently got this Hello Kitty compact mirror it's so pretty I already have the handheld mirror if you guys saw my other haul and this time I wanted to buy the compact mirror because it's so cute and then I also got my Ralph Lauren perfume oh okay so last but not least I'm gonna tell you guys what I got at Ulta these products right here from Ulta I got I want to say like three to four months ago I'm not kidding you probably like three months ago and I have not opened them probably some maybe like two or three products but not all of them okay so let's get started because I got a lot of products they were having a sale on NYX whenever I went it was like 40% off every NYX product and I was like what so I got a bunch of stuff and I mainly got stuff just because I noticed that in my videos I have been using a lot of MAC or a lot of Lorac or not Lorac but a lot of MAC or like higher end products and I did want to have more affordable products that everyone can purchase. This NYX Curve Eyeliner so I wanted to try this and I haven't opened it it's still in the box. Okay, so then I also got a bunch of these Violent Lips. 
ta temporary tattoos. They're only $3.99 each. And you get like three of them in a pack. And I haven't opened or used any of them. So this is how they look like. I got the pink cheetah print. As you can tell, I've been loving pink lips. So I got this one. And I also got the original color cheetah print. And then I got a bunch of the iRock um, little crystal thingies that you stick on your eye they're mainly they're basically crystals that you put on your eye so you can look really awesome and I haven't tried these out but I want to try them out oh yeah this stuff is from the cell rack okay? okay so in the cell rack I also found some Katy Perry lashes these retail for like I want to say twenty dollars like this whole kit right here it's not like individual packages like it's one whole kit and one two three four it comes with four lashes and i got it for 9.99 which i thought it was a pretty good deal but then after i went to the beauty supply store and i paid a dollar for one pair of lashes i was like i could have gotten nine pairs instead of four what a ripoff then i got this nyx palette right here i think it's pretty for fall like fall colors so I probably won't be using it anytime soon, but I thought it was a great deal. So I also got the Lorac Glow Getter Palette, and I do have a tutorial called Summer Makeup Using the Lorac Glow Getter Palette or something like that. But I'm basically using this palette. I already did a tutorial, so if you want to watch that, then go check that out. Okay, so I also got some new Maybelline color tattoos. I love these tattoos. I probably have over 10 of them. I just got three new shades from their, I think it's spring or summer collection. I got the one in Shady Shores, which is the yellow one. And then I got this one. This one's more of a blue with purple iridescence to it. This was probably like my favorite one out of all three of them and it's the seashore frost which is a really pretty color I honestly I cannot describe it it's kind of like a light blue with gold iridescence to it so pretty Woof. okay so that completes my haul I hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys have any video requests just send me a message or comment it on the comments down below I hope you guys have a fantabulous a grossome day that means great and awesome put together. Alright, so thanks for watching. Bye-bye!